All right, what's up guys? Welcome back to another video. Today we are going to check out a car. I'm headed to the bank right here. Um, as soon as I pull in here and get the cash, we're gonna go meet up with Cole. We're gonna go take a 30 minute drive, check out the car and see what's going on. All right, so we are now just leaving the bank. I got the cash here. Um, I'll tell you guys more about this car we're going to look at as soon as we get in the car and actually go check it out. Um, it's about a 30 minute drive. We're not going to take the truck. I think we'll be taking the new TDI Jetta. So uh, I'll see you guys when we um, get in the car and get on the road. What up, dude? What's up? Oh, we're taking the TDI today. No, no, no. Surprise. Had to, had to show up in the Tacoma, you know? There we go. Alright guys, so we're currently like a few miles out, probably a 10 minute drive, we're almost there, um, I haven't explained what we're going to look at, I'm just going to say it now because I don't really want to film when we go look at the car, um, we'll probably film the test drive and stuff, but I don't want to just put the camera in the guy's face, we're going to look at a 98 318i and not the TI, like not a hatchback, but we're just going to look at a sedan, it is a, what is that? Morea, Moria Green. I don't know, it's a weird color. It's a funky color. It's a cool color though. Um, we were hoping that it wouldn't be so wet, but as you can see, it's not really working out in our favor. As long as the sun's out and it doesn't continue to rain, uh, I think it'll be pretty money and we'll be able to just make this quick and fast when we get back home. Check the car out there. All right guys, so we are pulling up right now. We're looking for it here. Um, got that car purchase anxiety, but uh, we should be getting close. Mm. Make a left here, and it's up here on the left. I see it. Oh, there she is. The garage is open. Let's go check it out. There's a sneak peek. being honest i think this is a pretty good deal no matter which way you look at it i mean if this thing exploded right now uh we would sell the doors and be yeah. back at stage one exactly uh so i am gonna just come out and say it. we spent 1200 bucks on this car i spent 1200 bucks it was like and it's a low mileage Jeep i mean so it's 115,000 and yes it is a four cylinder it's the m44 but um regardless it got me 30 miles to the gallon all the way home and that's kind of what kind of why i bought this car hence why it's a uh, automatic here because i need something for school and i was driving an oldsmobile intrigue that i talked about selling in the last video and um that just wouldn't cut it i miss the e36 body style the interior everything about this car that makes it the car that it is i just miss the car this one came up for uh 2400 bucks and i talked to the guy over a month ago we've been messaging back and forth for like over a month that was still when i had that oldsmobile i just wanted this car really bad and last night i asked him i said hey what are you gonna take for it if we come pick it up tomorrow um he said 1200 bucks because it does have uh, an existing issue which is some notorious issues for these uh these four cylinders on these cars so it's nothing out of the ordinary um if anything we just got to get a new cap for it so she's smog legal other than that so far so good the temps have stayed really good the car you know it's slow but it's supposed to be slow it's the slowest out of the lineup yeah, it's not it, supposed to be fast no it's no nice, it's not supposed it to, is nice the interior is phenomenal for its age i mean i can't even explain to you um and i guess if you guys see this if you've owned a u36 before maybe you see this um it's not the typical setup um it's very 
very nice having a sedan. I can already say it. it's like, dude, the four doors. I missed the look. Um, the coupe was a piece of shit. And this is a clean example of what this car should look like. Um, there's some things and you know, for 21 years old, this car is immaculate, like mm -hmm. for its age. Um, obviously there are some things we're gonna do here and there to clean it up, but so far, so good. It's driving really well and I'm stoked on it, so. It's the same chassis, you know? Yeah, it's the same one. And it's nice. God damn, it's so nice. I mean, this is literally the same chassis as, you know, a sedan M3, you know? Yeah. Aside from subframe and suspension, it's the same chassis. It just has that balance, you know? Yeah, exactly. Yo, okay, so we got the ox working. It's got an aftermarket head unit, but we're slapping in here. Just got new wipers, too. All right, well, as you guys can see, here is my new BMW 318i. It is a 1998 sedan. Yes, it's automatic. Um, it's got nothing done to it. It is bone stock. First thing we did though, when we got it is I wanted to get some new wipers. We put some new wipers on here. I want to go ahead and show you guys the interior here. This car is super, super clean. Has to be the cleanest 98 I've ever seen. Honestly, this is the cleanest 98 I've ever seen. Only mod to this whole car is this uh, head unit that was installed. All right, now, um, sorry, oh, fuck. This video has been all over the place, um, but we are gonna go ahead and start this bitch up. Now, car definitely needs plugs. The car definitely needs plugs soon because she normally is a little rough on cold start. Other than that, car drives really well. Um, it has had the PCV done, the valve cover gasket done, cooling system flush rebuilt. Um, I'll talk more about it. I'm going to Kohl's right now. We're going to fix up these headlights, but uh, I'll talk to you when I get there. Sorry, it's been so all over the place. I haven't had time to film. It's not Wednesday. I got the car on Saturday. This is the first chance I even got to pick the camera back up. Um, but I'll get back to you guys in a second.